Hello guys, my name is Mamdu Kayat. I'm an attending at The Ohio State University. I did my residency at The Ohio State University and did my fellowship training at the University of Michigan prior to the inception of the IR residency. Um, and today you'll be walking in the day of kind of our day-to-day -day practice and what we do. Um, our first case is a gentleman um, that presents with symptoms of benign prostatic hypertrophy. He has pronounced hesitancy when it comes to his urination, nocturia, uh, inability to generate a robust stream, um, and has been intermittently placing a Foley to help him urinate. Our patient is scheduled to get prostate artery embolization. It's a minimally invasive treatment option for patients with BPH, where we catheterize the prostatic arteries and treat them with small particles as to induce ischemia and decrease the size of the prostate and improve the symptoms of their BPH. with the microcatheter positioned exactly where we want it to be. Ideally in the suspected uh, prostatic branch, we do a, a Dyna CT or a CT spin on the table uh, to confirm the microcatheter position. We certainly don't want any potential for non-target embolization, so we want to exclude perfusion to branches uh, that contribute to the urinary bladder or the rectum. And so as you come down, you notice that there's adequate enhancement of the uh, left side of the prostate with no perfusion uh, to the rectum or the bladder. So that was our first case of the day. Our second case is a gentleman that presents to us with a history of uh, acute cholecystitis necessitating cholecystostomy tube placement. He is a non-operative candidate and we presume he has stones in place. So today he is scheduled for percutaneous cholangioscopy where spyglass will be used to visualize the gallbladder um, and target treatment of that stone, hopefully fragment that stone and remove uh, all the stone fragments to get him on the road to becoming tube free. So today we have clinic scheduled. The way that our uh, schedule is structured, our clinic is scheduled after our call day. And so today we see a combination of various patients, some that have had prior procedures with us um, and are here for follow-up and others that are scheduled to have procedures with us and they're just generalized consults that we evaluate and then uh, work them up for uh, ensuing procedure. So that's a typical day for us here in interventional radiology at the Ohio State University. As you can see, it is a unique specialty at the intersection of minimally invasive procedures, heavy clinical practice, and diagnostic imaging. Hopefully you enjoyed what you saw and we hope to see you back soon.